All right, but our next one is uh is our requisite Kickstarter game for the week. As it as it seems to go. I'm just glad there's like a decent number of games on Kickstarter right now that actually have demos. I I can't understand doing a Kickstarter for a video game and not having a demo. This one is Ada. Uh, this is a uh, a top-down action RPG. Uh, really detailed pixel art. It's reminding me of Songbringer a little bit. I feel like I might have looked at this before, but I definitely didn't do it on demo disc because it's not in the backlog. Uh, So I don't know. I'm, I might have like looked at it and then been like, like I just I I found it because this is the second time that they've done this campaign. They did it earlier. It did not meet, not meet the goal. Uh, yeah. You you need to have something that uh, that people can play just to like get a feel for the game in their own hands. Like yeah, being able to uh, to see things in action that's pretty useful, but you know you are playing it, um, which I should just start playing it and stop talking. How's about that? Controller. This is a Kickstarter demo. It may be buggy, it may break. Cheers. Yeah, the, uh... There's the first bit of buggy. The, uh, the D-pad is not detected correctly. So, keyboard and mouse it is. No, I want to see what the controls are, but I guess we'll figure it out. A little dodge roll. Do not poke the ghoul. I didn't poke it, for the record, I swiped it. It was like a soft and hard attack. I guess E is our interact. Yeah, I don't know how to use these potions. Hmm. You cannot stress it enough. That doesn't seem to be an interactable thing. Maybe it is, I don't know. I've taken a lot of damage. And I would like to heal. That's not how. <laughs> That's not how you heal. <laughs> But uh, now I know I have grenades. I have grenades, but I don't have a means of, of recovering health. Nor do I have any idea where to go next. I mean, I have to... That's how I'm aiming attacks, because I can't use a controller. So, sorry. Hmm. 
Okay, that's that. I mean, I poked the ghoul, which I was told not to. I guess we, uh, go along this way. Activate. Okay, but like I can't seem to activate it and be on the stairs? A puzzle. The mystery of what am I doing? Okay, that looked dangerous. These things are also, like, quite dangerous. I could go for anything that would heal me right now. Uh, would super appreciate that. It's an interesting way to do, like, underground kind of thing. Two heal crystal. I have an inventory. Ah, okay. There's my heal button. Kaka. Her car. I don't think I can go anywhere. <clears throat> anywhere in that direction yet. This seems like another. Oh no, this one will actually stay up. No, like, battle moment mu music. It's called pressing the wrong button. Hello, car. Try not to fall. I'm not having a problem with the falling, I'm having a problem with these things. There we go. It would not let me continue. Anyway, I activated it and I don't know what I got from that. I also feel like there's no way to avoid taking that damage. And no way down? How do I get down? 
Oh. I also think I'm out of heals. Homing beacon, maybe a teleporter kind of thing? There we go. It's just like a little wonky to use, is all. It didn't give an indication that like those connected. Didn't highlight. Also, there's like no sound of that thing attacking, and it really seems like there should be. Seems like that should be rather impactful. Yeah, I have no heals. No heals left. I would like to buy some not dying juice. If anyone's got any? Pekala? Hello, little spiderling. Have you seen my spiders? I don't know, what have I done? Where did Spider Lady go? Why is my camera stuck? I feel like I'm messing up the camera doing this. You know, I saw a, uh, a demon-y thing behind it. Sure. But like, I can't get the camera to move. feel slightly stuck in there. So I'm going to reboot. And uh, see if I can maybe not break it this time. <laughs> okay. If I get hit while activating... Oh, and now the stairs work fine. Now we can activate that. There's one over there. Alright. Now I feel like I, I have some idea of what's happening. Perhaps I want to be over here doing something with the ghoul. But I was told not to poke. Hmm. <clears throat> like there was a whole, uh... I think there was a whole shard collection thing. Yeah, in this well.
Do not poke the ghoul. Get way up there. <clears throat> Doesn't actually take me anywhere. We go over here and there's nothing. Although the trees started separating in a way that really implied there would be. I'll leave the ghoul alone for now. For now. That's got to be a thing that we uh, eventually learn how to activate. Very rude. No, no sound for that. I find myself just wanting more sound effects, you know? Want to hear enemies attacking a bit better. I caught it. Um, let's see, break this. So now we have three heal crystals, it looks like. It's a whole thing that I don't think I uh, gave a look at yet. Hmm. It's a long, slow attack and doesn't do any more damage. Kind of no, uh, no value in it, it would seem. Yeah, there's no way to avoid that damage. And now there's no way to get over there? Um... Kaka! 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 Fire potions. Okay. Hmm. So that's what those are. Yeah, we just now we just straight up cannot get up there now. But because it uh, it lowered the thing, and then killed us. That sucks. And it still gets stuck here.
Like, this doesn't... This doesn't do anything. Like... Like, there's nothing I can do. Q filled dark ink. I don't have dark ink. I don't know how to apply the concept of dark ink. I can't talk to the sad painter. Like... <clears throat> I get that this is... Like, it's, it's going to be a little buggy. I, I get that. But consistently, I'm hitting the same exact bug. And it's, it's just like a soft lock. Like, the, the camera gets stuck here. And doesn't know what to do. I wonder if there's, like, an intended... ...route through this? And they tested the route, and it ends here. But they didn't test, like, if you diverge from the route. This is, like, an, a beta, like, Kickstarter demo sort of thing. This is nowhere near the full product. Um... But I'm I'm worrying this is like a uh, a poster child for <laughs> QA process. Uh, mm -mm. So like they they expect you to play it one way, and once you start playing it a different way, it starts to fall apart. Well, I mean this this is what's freely available. You don't have to back it to get. Access to the demo I just played. Um, you know, I do not, uh, I do not feature anything on demo disc uh, that is not f available to anyone for free. Um, I have done that in the past. I'm no longer doing that, uh, just because it doesn't, it doesn't feel right. Um, yeah, I, f I think that entire, like, using those things as teleporters, just, I mean, it worked once, but I don't see how you make that work consistently. I, I don't even know how I made it happen the first time. Um, and like it's they, they advertise like having like proc gen and all that I don't think that's enabled or that's like built in with uh, with what's in the demo because again layout was the same uh, which is all well and good like I'm not complaining there uh You know, it's just it does it doesn't show that one feature. But uh Yeah, I feel like it just it wasn't it wasn't working right. I mean I guess like if you're putting out a Kickstarter or you don't want this reaction, you wouldn't put out a demo, but... 
you know, if you don't have a demo, then I have no idea if it is going to work right or work or not work right. And I would be inclined to uh, to be skeptical. It's like, hey, at least they're putting it out. At least they're putting it out there. Um, I cannot like guarantee that that is the most up to date version of it. Um, but it is the one that they have on their Kickstarter. They also have it on itch.io and I didn't like compare versions. So that like itch.io might be the old one. Itch.io might be a newer one. Um, but either way, yeah, that, uh, when, when it wasn't buggy, it felt all right. Um, I, I feel like, uh, I feel like Luca did that kind of action and perspective and movement tighter. Uh, which, you know, this, this can tighten it up and, and get to that point, but it wouldn't need to do so. Uh, yeah, you, there's definitely, there's a definite Dark Souls little nudge in there. Uh, which, I mean, every game seems to have that. Uh, there's not an automatic, uh, guarantee of quality or poor quality. But, uh, yeah, it was just, it was just too buggy. Too consistently buggy, I would say. I was, I was able to do the same thing and make it break multiple times. <laughs> 